system. behind big business, um, always siding with business against with people. people. And uh, excited to learn about this process that's of, of another reason why the lawn, which basically in a country where we only have two parties, you have to sometimes hold your nose and vote for the one that's going to at least going to appoint better Supreme Court justices because that. That's Just the key like to a lot of things. So let's not forget um, that Obama did appoint two pretty good England. Supreme Court justices. So we're trying to swing the balance a little more back to the Senate. Do you brand. think that we need a third party or additional parties in this country, or do you think that we can change the system from within the current structure? You know, the only way multiple parties would work in this country is if we had a parliamentary system, which we don't. You know, we don't have a system like the European countries, where that's where multiple parties Work. We don't form coalition governments. So I doubt if we're going to get a, a page one rewrite of the Constitution to make that happen. And as long as we have the system we have, I think we're always going to have to live with this two-party system. Third parties historically only draw votes away from the party you actually are favoring. Which, which is a problem in its own. That is a problem in its own. But I think we have to, I think we have to pick one of them to go to bed with. And then, and then one last thing, what would you, I think I already really asked it, but what would you say to the people, how do we rally them, truly get them off their couch, away from the TV, away from American Idol, and out on the stage? That's right. Well, I, I think that's happening. You know, I think people are just fed up. Yep. And Look, Americans love convenience. It's very hard to persuade well them from the sops they are thrown by corporate America. But when it gets to the point, and of course your allies in this are your enemies, the big business people, who keep making life worse and worse for the regular citizens of this country. And it takes a lot, you're right, to get them off the edge. But it's certain point, like the movie said, they're going to stand up and say, I'm fed up. I'm mad as hell. I'm if, not going to take it. If you build it, they will come. Yeah, <laughs> and you, you built it, so congratulations. All right. Well, thank you very much for coming right. down. We really appreciate it. Thank, thank you. you. Well, where's your tent? <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah! Bring your tent. Great to hear you here, man. I've got to go back.